In those early days, there were choices to make and directions to choose. Life was in a hurry to unfold, yet impatience wished the years away, like newspaper pages caught by the wind, taking momentary flight. All those words and those stories, finding sudden wings, hoping to find a comfortable place in the world of dreams. You had to choose, but choose within the bounds of school counsellors, parents, society. You couldn't choose to be a musician. That would have to come later. That was just a dream. You had to make a living. So you put down your guitar and burned your book of songs scribbled from the heart. You went to business college and learned to type reports and letters to whom it may concern. You were young and the world seemed boundless, but it taught you to conform. You could walk through many doors, but it was sometimes hard to choose the one that would lead to a version of you. So many doors would beckon and so many close in your face. There were many that made you welcome, but you weren't sure if this was your place. Work, they say, is good for the soul. I say it depends on what you do. And there is flesh and spirit to draw and to drive. Sometimes the choices are out of your control. They are no choice at all. Our instincts get the better of us, but we learn and go on choosing. In the end, we may learn to do what's best, but for whom? Perhaps we maximize happiness, create the greatest good. We know we should be happy and loved, but that depends on the choice of door and how we shake those ghosts that shadow our paths. Then one day the sky is clear, we see the clouds for what they are or what they might become. We see ourselves and our choices and walk back to those early doors, look beyond the dark passages, or look lovingly at memories in the corners of candlelit rooms, taste wine and tears and skin gently close the eyelids of the dead, let our dreams rise to the surface and waft like incense to perfume our remaining days. Remember we lived and learned and loved and chose. We hurt and cared and carried on, choosing to live. And when we arrive, our regrets may be few for the choices we made that we cannot undo, that painted our history on the canvas of time.